Hey guys, it's Pablo here with another video, guys. Um, in this video, we're gonna learn um, the parts that are inside the toilet tank, the functional and the mechanical parts, the name, what it does, and how to replace it also, also to get repair. Well, when you see the toilet and you go to the tap of the toilet, that's the toilet tank. You remove the cover, the tap, and after you open it, you will see immediately the fluid level water valve. You also want to see in this case a different flapper assembly. You also see the handle, the chains that hold the flapper assembly all the way on the bottom. Outside the tank, you're going to have the connector feeding metal, which is going to have a cap that holds it tight so it doesn't leak. And you're going to have the flexible hose go to the wall valve to cut off the water for the toilet, correct? Well, let's talk about this part right here. This part, the fluid level valves, um, the fill valve, whatever, it has different names. It's in charge to, you know, allow water to flow to the toilet tank and it wanna get to a specific level and this piece raise up, it stop the water immediately so it doesn't overflow. You also have the overflow or preventing flow here, which is also provide water to the bowl when you flush it. Um, the flopper, what it does is, it's stopping the water from going in. It has like a, a soft material, like a plastic soft material to last longer, but over time, because inside the water all the time, it, it wear off and, and it get defective and it needs to be replaced. Uh, you have the handle, which when you flush it, you push it down. In this case, it, they have different models, but in this one, you push it down. This place up, which is the flapper assembly, and allow water to go to the bowl, which flows the toilet tissues, or number one and number two, whatever. Um, let's talk about the fluid level, how to replace it. Um, I got the old one, the one that I changed. That's the one that was defected. That one, where, what happened was, it was not stopping the water. So even when this was going out, which is the valve to cut the water from keep flowing to the toilet, it was continuing running. That means the mechanism inside here was defective. So I replaced that part. I replaced the whole thing. Um, as you can see, it's a male adapter here, which should go through the bowl, which should go through the toilet tank, and it has a knot. They hold it tight, and you can see it has this rubber gasket seal, which when you tighten it, it prevents water from leaking. Um, it's, easy to, it's easy to replace this bar. Um, it costs like $20, $30 in Home Depot Lowe's. And Amazon costs like eight bucks. Um, well, uh, that's it for today, guys. I'll keep you guys posted.